What is up heroes, and welcome back to Small Pokemon XD, Gale of Darkness. Last episode, we started making our way through Cypher's lair, battled a few people, caught a few shadow Pokemon. In today's episode, we're going to continue going through the lair, hopefully get quite far. I'm aiming to maybe get to the next admin, which will probably be Gorgon or that guy's name, I don't remember. I call him Crowler because he looks like the professor from Yu-Gi-Oh! GX, and we got an email from Egan. Dying with... wait, what? I got another email, okay. Oh. Divulty, hello, this is my first email. I am sorry that I sent an empty message by mistake. Oh, okay, that makes sense. I was gonna say. I also apologize for the misspellings. I was gonna say as well, because it said it said like Cyphet or something like that. I'm embarrassed by these mistakes and W. Email text is cut off. Are we gonna get another one? Let's look at the first one again. Where is it? Uh mailbox. <laughs> Down with uh Cyphet. And it's empty. Okay. So we're going to get another email from Egan soon, I guess. And this place is looking pretty cool. Oh, can we actually get this? It's too hot to approach. How do I... Oh, God. Ah, oh, the mirror. Okay, that's fine. I thought that was something else. Is there a chest around here? Nope. Okay, maybe I can... Push this. Aha! Wait. If I can push that, can I push the one up there then? Let's go push that right now, see if I can. I keep expecting like wild Pokemon just to kind of appear, but obviously this game isn't like that, and there we go. Ah, that's how you get the crate. If only wild Pokemon were in this game, it would be pretty cool. Well, they are technically, but I meant like random encounters right now. To revive, so that was kind of worth it. That is definitely going to help out. Because now I have so many revives, I want to get that one. How do I get that? I need to get on that side and push it down. So I still need to explore the other side as well. Ooh, now we can go down there. Oh, I can't actually go down that way, okay. Yeah, the, the paths are kind of hard to see. They're kind of merged in with the, the brown. So what's the point of pushing... Oh, okay, I guess... I, I know, okay, I understand. I guess what's the point of pushing that one, but it cuts off the lava so we can walk across. That makes sense. But we're going to have to run all the way back in a second. Just so... Oh, no, we have to run back anyway have to go inside there, but now we can get that crate. It's kind of funny, I actually had a dream last night where I was running away from lava. It was weird, and now I'm actually playing this game and there's lava everywhere. <laughs> that is weird. But come on crate, you know you want to have something really really good inside. That would make my day, we should go down this side. Oh, can't even get round. And we're going to get ourselves a white herb. And I went to the PC because we've got too many items. <laughs> okay, that's fine. So, what have we got in here? Oh, God. Hello. You're hanging, you're hanging tough in this magma hot heat. I thought I was going to melt waiting. Why are you waiting? Did you know I was here or did you just kind of chill there? Grupple. <laughs> Cypher P and Gruple. Gruple, I think, no, I think it's Gruple. Yeah, Gruple. You got a weird name. Hound him in a Ninetales, damn. If that Ninetales has got the uh, the drought, that's gonna suck. And then it goes Mega Houndoom, and that is a very good combination for a doubles team. Because Mega Houndoom gets more powerful, and it's... That'd be terrible, but we are good. I don't need to switch out, actually. I can do this. Just gonna be careful with the Houndoom. Um, if we... Psychic that. And we're gonna break break this. Confuse rate. Ah. Oh. I hate confuse rate so much. Don't hit Gardevoir. I know we're gonna hit it's gonna hit Gardevoir and it's gonna flinch me. Oh no, you're gonna hit Squall, okay, that's that's perfectly fine. Didn't get flinched. Hell yeah! Come on, critical hit as well! Ha <laughs> ha, in your face, Houndoom. Do you see what you get? Do you see what you get when you mess with the warrior? Yeah. 
Okay, what else? What else? Got probably a fire team, I assume. Oh, no, a wild plume. Okay, no fire team here. Ouch. I'm gonna psychic that and then I'm gonna crush claw vile plume. I'm glad I did now because I went for dig. I kind of thought vile plume would be kind of a nuisance, so it's probably best to get rid of it, get rid of it now. Whereas nine towers is just yeah, nine towers isn't gonna do much damage to be fair. Someone is gonna get hit with a dig, so gotta be careful with that. A magma. Oh god, butt face! <laughs> oh god, butt face is a shadow Pokemon. Okay, let's let's capture butt face. Uh, I'm gonna shadow ball him. That should do too much. And then nine tails is gonna come out on a crush claw. Nine tails. So this is probably gonna kill me. I wouldn't be surprised. Oh wait, nope. Come on, dig, hit Gardevoir, hit Gardevoir, hit Gardevoir. Yes. That was lucky. That was very lucky. Come on, get through the confusion. Oh, Gardevoir, no. Okay, uh, Zangus is going to die next hit. Because... But face will go for a shadow rave, so I'm gonna go switch out into Wally. And then Gardevoir can take a shadow rave, but if Nine Tails hits it, then it's dead and I switch out the wrong Pokemon. And I'm gonna Shadow Ball Magma and then switch out into Wally. That's what we do. Shadow Rush, okay. Hit Wally, nice. Did a lot of damage though, but at least they didn't kill him. Well, kill the Adivore either. Play for up, please on Wally, please on Wally. Nice, this is good stuff. So lucky there, so lucky. Thank you, game, for being bad. You're gonna burn Wally, he is taking a pounding, Jesus. That did like nothing. Wow. But Wally's gonna die, so doesn't really matter what I go for. If he lives, I'll be surprised. Oh, two HP. Nine tails, go for dig, go for dig. Yes! Oh my god, that was so good. Oh Jesus! Okay, icy wind shouldn't kill him. Actually, it won't kill him. Guarantee it won't kill him. Don't kill him. Please don't kill him. Good. Good, good. Just lower his speed. And that's what we want. Obviously, he's going to miss nine tails. And then Wally's gone. This to capture magma. Oh, about to use the master ball then. Ultra ball, there you are. Can't even see that for a second. And then I'm gonna go for a sky uppercut on nine tails. Hopefully, I don't outspeed nine tails. I shouldn't do. Pretty sure nine tails will outspeed my Goomba, but if I outspeed it, then that sucks. Come on. Yes, there we go. Got butt face. I guarantee he's got one more. I bet that's a shadow. Yep. Okay. Two shadow Pokemon, that's not bad. Pincer. Getting a good old dick pinch. Getting this for Hayden. Which is also my name, but still. Uh, let's go into. Sack, because Sack will definitely outspeed Ninetales, but Ninetales are probably going to be dead now, so it doesn't really matter. 
just in case uh, Goomba can't finish it off. I'm pretty sure he misses, so I'm pretty happy I went for this. And headbutt pincer. Couldn't finish it off, please paralyze it. Oh. I can just imagine getting headbutted by Pinsir. That would probably be the most painful thing in existence. Ugh. Just remember on the anime when uh, I think it was uh, Pinsir's. Uh, pins I guess the pincers, aren't they? Is <laughs> things on his head? <laughs> pincers, pincers. Uh, the things like hurting the uh, the metapod, kind of crushing him. That was that was brutal. He's got a weird mouth as well. Alright, let's quick attack nine tails. As well as I wish I had mock punch still, but I got rid of it. Let's try and get lucky with Pinsa. Ah, oh, not a chance. Come on, Flareon, take out nine tails. That would be pretty swell. Nice. Oh my god, I'm so lucky. And please, Pinsa, hit Flareon. The annoying thing is, I'm gonna have to run back and heal up now. But I kind of feel like just using my revive and stuff because I'm I'm not that far away from the healing station, but it's like a four-minute walk away. Just four minutes there and back. Do I wanna? save the revives and heal up or do I want to just use them and just carry on? I kind of want to go to the healing station but then again I don't. Oh god this is such a hard decision and if this pins has got a attack that hits both Pokemon I am screwed. So I'm gonna crush claw him and then I'm gonna risk it with an ultra ball again just in case he does try and kill us both with one attack. That would be terrible. Come on, Pinsa. You know you want to be part of the uh, the army. No, Pinsa. He doesn't want to join my army of shadow Pokemon. Please, he's in attack on one. Please hit the Goomba. Crap. Okay, I'm going to lose this battle. Could go for a, a, a revive, but whatever I revive is going to get hit by a shadow hit next turn and die anyway so there's no point in doing it. Just gonna have to risk it for the biscuit. Let's go Ultra Ball. If I lose it's not a big problem. I'd rather not lose. Yes! Oh my god yes! <laughs> Woo! That was... That was lucky, that was... That was nothing but luck there. So do I go in there? Oh, I'm gonna heal up, I'm gonna go heal up, so I'll see you in... a bit. Okay, we're back nice and healthy, let's head through here. Oh, what is going on? Someone's gonna drop from the ceiling, you know they are. I can't see him. Oh god, there was a healing station just there. I walked all the way back. <laughs> it took so long and there's one there. This is like the third time it's happened in this game. Oh my god, that's so... I'm using it anyway, I don't care. My Pokemon are healthy, I'm going to heal up just because... Oh, that's so annoying. That's the third time that's happened in this game. <laughs> I hate this game. Alright, let's head, head through here. Ooh, this place is getting... we got a nice PC there. Hello. You look cute. You're so brave and bold to come to a place like this. So, pretty cute, eh? Wanna go on a date? Nah, I'm sorry, I don't date evil people. Oh! Alright, let's go with Kim Lee. Gonna mind you, yeah, That's gonna be pretty easy to beat. Pretty easy, cause Zangus can just break, break everything. That's gonna be so easy. Well, I probably want to get rid of the uh, Mighty Unit first. Can that Intimidate? That is not nice. Oh, double Intimidate. Oh, Jesus. 
At least it's not as bad as the uh, Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Mega Ruby. I think it was the Delta episode with the five Intimidates. That was so annoying. But that was pretty cool. Like a five on one battle. That was actually really awesome. I'm gonna get flinched. I am gonna get flinched so hard. Oh wait, it's fine. I really thought he was gonna go for Gardevoir, so that is fine. Get a crit, get a crit, get a crit. I, I, honestly, I honestly thought it'd be more than that. I know Dark Super Effective against Ghost, but I kind of thought eh, it should do a bit of damage because the only thing I can really do against it. And technically, I could probably go with Calm Mind and just psychic the rest of his Pokemon. So I can't Shadow Ball the Stantler, but I can psychic it. Calm Mind, and then we're gonna break that again. Stupid Intimidate making me so weak, and I missed! Of course I miss! If that hits Gardevoir, I'm so dead. It is going to hit Gardevoir because obviously it won't affect Zangus. Ouch! I love the anim animation for Calm Mind on like XY, uh, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. It looks so good, and he's going to bite Gardevoir and kill it. Yes! Okay, we're good, we're good. We have Stantler goes for Gardevoir. I am so dead. Kill Zangus. I'll reflect, that's absolutely fine, buddy. That is fine. This lady really doesn't like physical attacks, does she? Intimidates, reflects. Oh, our Psychic is doing work! Nice! Oh, so close level 33 as well. Prophecy. I need to take XP off Prophecy. I keep forgetting to do that. I said I'll do it like two episodes ago and I just keep forgetting. You got Zangus as well. That is going to be pretty hard to beat. Oh, 1 HP! Your oh, God of War is a monster. That is actually awesome. I, I bet Zangus is going to attack God of War. Cool shattered, that's awesome. And you are dead. Looking back, I should have really switched out as soon as the double, in, in, double intimidate came, but I kind of thought, I need the XP. Would have got it anyway, but still. Better just to do this. Sharpedo, that is not going to be a shadow Pokemon because it's got the Kavana. Hit Zangoose. Oh, <laughs> damn it. I'm sorry, God of all, you did good. You did good. So I'm going to bring out my sack. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. Just thinking, there's not much point training Electrode and Zangus when I plan to switch them for a Manetric and uh, Salamence. Well, that was awesome. Sunflora! Is it a shadow? It's not a shadow, okay. I think she has one more Pokemon, or that's it. I think that's it, to be honest. Taunt? That is fine! Yep, last two Pokemon, that's fine. Uh, I'm gonna... Self-destruct because I can. There's a healing station just outside, might as well. And crush claw. Not gonna live it, but still. One down. Come on. Kill everything. Kill everything. As two down. One more. One more. You got this electrode. So close. Uh, bring out prophecy. Oh, I forgot we had two Pokemon. Got 
Prophecy is almost level 40. That is actually pretty good. Quick attack and headbutt. Quick attack should finish it off. Definitely go heal up after this, and then I might quickly switch some Pokemon around in the in the um, the PC, just so more Pokemon can get purified a bit quicker. Because I think some have been well, not I say purified. The Shadow Gauge has been put down, and Mirror B Radar has gone off again. But we can't really do anything, can we? Can't even. There we go. Anything that can be purified. Nope, nope, nope. Beedrill can, okay. So we'll switch Beedrill out. If I can purify some Pokemon, I can get these four. Wait, no, that can't be purified. It needs a teeny bit more. As you can see, these three are like glowing white. This one's still glowing uh, bluey purple. Okay, that's fine. Uh, let's put you in, like, oh no, I'll keep it there. Um, right, uh, let's head up. And it looks like we have lots of trainers and okay, dear Volti, I hope you are well. I wrote you a haiku poem. If Team Snagum go if Team Snagum goons cause trouble in the desert, go and sandbag them. <sighs> that was so bad. That was horrendous. Oh my goodness. Okay. Alright, so to get all these chests, I need to battle a lot of people, so let's start off with this lady right here. Okay, maybe I don't have to battle them. Two hyper potions, that's not bad. But I'm going to battle you anyway. Sorry, this is a dead end. That's not saying, people, I, I should really take XP show off prophecy, I forgot again. It keeps slipping my mind. Like something keeps happening and I just... Okay, after this battle, I will remember, I swear to God, I will remember. Mark my words, okie dokie, let's go for switch. There we go. gonna put on XP share on Gardevoir after this battle. Yeah, we'll train her up like that. Because XP share is just the best way to train. The Pokemon gets so much more XP. So much more better. Alrighty, so we're gonna flame for a one and I see win both. Maybe get some shadow Pokemon around here, that would be pretty swell. Hey, level 40, nice. Damn right, you lower their speed. Actually did a fair amount of damage, it's not bad. Right, Flamethrower to finish you off. Uh, no, Flamethrower to finish you off, and then I see when to finish Beautifly off, and then something else that will come out.
It was a beautiful I might go for Mega Drain. Which would suck. Hopefully it doesn't. Oh, we are speeding now, nice. Volbeat, her last Pokemon. Yeah, I thought so. I don't like this duo. I, I've never liked Volbeat or Lumise. Oh, did not mean to switch. Helping hand, ooh, new. No. It's fine. Oh, that's not too much. I'm gonna do anything. Because Flamethrower is gonna kill you so hard. Freeze it, freeze it. No. Oh. Okay, there's one down and three more battles to go. So I can't tell you what I'm doing at this dead end. Okay, that's fair enough. Okay, oh, XP share. I remembered. I remembered. Wait, oh, there's no room to take it off, is there? Okay, that's fine, that's fine. What we'll do is... Switch it for charcoal. Give XP share to Gardevoir. That'll do. And we'll have... That for a bit. Alright, let's get these two crits over here. You're going this way? I don't think that's a wise decision. Because you have to beat me to go this way. If anything, that's the best of de decision. Hey, Bram, you are going to get destroyed. damage as we can. Was kind of hoping you'd die from that, but you stayed in pretty well. Ooh, don't do too much damage. Don't poison, don't poison. And bite. Ooh. That's fine, I can finish you off though. Although, you're not doing anything, so I might as well... Take the Weezen out. While he's just gonna sit there for like a turn and a bit. Doing nothing. Flinch it, flinch it. No! Oh my god, Zangoose misses a lot of attacks. He has missed quite a few. And the Weezing actually lived that Jesus. Ha! <laughs> you failed. 
Alright, so I'm gonna uh, scarf cut you and then crush claw you. Hopefully it lands a hit. Nice. Wobber for that, it's gonna. Ah, oh, god damn it, don't miss. Got the paralysis, so that's always, always very nice. It's a fair amount of damage, a few more hits. Hey, got the defense decreased, that's always great. Come on, and I missed again! No, Goomba! Destiny Bond, ooh, that is not nice. See, Goomba, if you landed the hit, he would have died. Just saying. You only died because you suck. For this battle. Uh, let's get Wally out. I want to kind of slowly take out the Whopper Fett, so I'm going to... Icy Wind. I'm not getting killed by Destiny Bond, Jesus. That sucks. That wasn't supposed to happen, but still. Just trying to slowly take his HP down, but... Ah, that's annoying. Rapid spin, okay. No box on the floor, so it's all good. And we're gonna hopefully finish this thing off now. Okay, you're gonna be dead. You actually live with a little bit of HP. This thing is being a pain in the butt. Damn, he just needs to go. That's redonkulous. This is a flamethrower. Killed you by one hit. That is good. That is very good. Get paralyzed, get paralyzed, get paralyzed. You stupid fortress. Scummery, that's going to be pretty easy to kill. He's setting up some spikes. Go for it. Don't plan to switch out anyway, so it's all good. That's where I miss. Oh no, that landed the hit. Nice. If I missed, I'd have been so upset. So upset. No way! Well, I have to quickly go heal up, so I will see you in a second. Okay, so we're nice and healthy. Let's grab these, and we can actually get them ones without going through here. Someone's, someone's gonna drop down, you know they are. Gonna PP up. Wait for it, wait for it. Someone's gonna drop. No one dropped. Awesome. Whoa, you're making a huge mistake if you think you can get past me without an incident. Oh, buddy, we are gonna make a huge incident right here. Kulig. <laughs> Such a weird name.
Alright, so I'm gonna Mega Drain this and I'm gonna Crush Claw this. Oh, when he gets hit, he puts his wings on his head like, no, don't hit me. Oh, Pelipper is so awesome. I really like Pelipper. And that barely did a thing, Jesus. Really thought I'd do a lot more damage and surf. Oh, God. Oh, Zangus, no, critical hit. Okay, I say we take out that right now before he starts doing some serious damage. Okay, Mega Drain should be able to finish him off. I think that's enough damage. Nice. Good, good, good stuff. No! What are you doing, buddy? You can't die yet. Ah, uh, so. Bring out Prophecy. He is gonna wreck everything. Headbutt you hopefully get the flinch. That's what I am betting on right now. And Flamethrower to take this out. off and flamethrower. See what you all do, because usually the flamethrower has been doing a lot, even on water Pokemon. It's been quite a lot of damage. Yeah, that's not bad. Burn it, burn it, burn it! Ah, oh, damn it. If only we got the burn, that would have been so good. And Prophecy's almost level 41, that is great and quillfish. this out. Thank god that missed. That's actually pretty good. And that's out. Nice. Almost there. Almost there. Look what it does, damn! So good, and pin missile, who are you hitting? Hit Flareon. Two times, only two times, not bad. Come on, finish it off. Oh, it barely does a thing. Just go for the same again, and that will be GG. Do it about the Cypher guy, and we can get this chest, and hopefully it is worth it. I was the one who made a huge mistake. You was. And we can't walk right past you. I know what you're after, so I'm not gonna let you pass. Oh, come on, man. Jago, that's not very nice. I want that chest. It's 
about to have some cool stuff in it. Oh, that's not good. I didn't want Lucas out because XP share. That is. Oh, he's got six Pokemon. He's bound to have a Shadow Pokemon as well. Okay. Um, keep you in for a bit. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Go, I'm gonna. Go, I'm gonna headbutt you, and then I'm gonna Shadow Ball you. Good damage, good damage. Psychic, oh god, don't hit Goomba, don't hit Goomba. No, Goomba! Oh, that was serious damage. Uh, let's bring out Prophecy. Do this nice and quick with flamethrowers. Should take out both the Pokemon, hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Nice, goodbye, Deli Bird. Get out of here. And what's coming out next? Hopefully, something pretty easy. Oh, these things are so annoying. That's fine, that's fine. So I'm gonna psychic. Well, I'm gonna flamethrower this and psychic that. And my voice is going a little bit. Oh god! I've been recording for almost an hour now, so that's what I get. My voice just starts to go, and it ain't good. One kill and one hit. That would be pretty swell. Good stuff. Golduck. That won't be a shadow because I already got one of them. Yeah, you lower the power of electricity Pokemon. That is good. I'm gonna go for a bite and then a shadow ball on the Golduck. Try to take this out. Or at least flinch it. Either way is good. Got the flinch. Good stuff. Not enough damage to take out in two hits. That is not great. Maybe a flamethrower might do a little bit more. Probably will, to be fair. Come on, flamethrower, do your stuff. Lots of damage. Should have gone for flamethrower first turn. Well, to be fair, got the flinch, so the flinch is always nice. And Water Pulse is going for Gunnival. Critical hit, though. Don't confuse me as well. That would suck. Wagsire. Is it a shadow? Is it a shadow? It is not. This guy's gonna be a pain in the butt to take out now. Two kind of annoying Pokemon. Alright, let's see if we can take this Quagsire or Quagsire out with a flamethrower on a psychic, that would be pretty good. Come on, psychic, you know you wanna finish it off? Yawn? Oh no, that's not great. I'm switching out Flareon then after this turn. Yes! Nice one, God of War. Nice. See, I'm feeling pretty confident I can take this thing out. So I'm gonna stay in. Come on! Do lots of damage! Come on, Psychic. Come on, Psychic. Come on, Psychic. Take down. Who are you taking down? Critical hit again. Well, there goes the Psychic. I ain't gonna kill it. And we 
got sacked. Oh, whoa. I felt pretty confident and it didn't work. Okay, one more spark and you you are so dead. Got the paralysis, nice. Get paralyzed, get paralyzed, ah, oh, damn it. Okay, prophecy is probably dead. And yet you went for nice. I assumed you were gonna was gonna go for a prophecy, but that's good and you're still asleep. But Spark is gonna finish you off. And we can finally, finally get this chest and hopefully it is good. It, it best be good. My voice is going. Been going through this lair for almost an hour now on this video. And I kind of want to quickly grab this chest and be amazed by it. An elixir, that's, that's alright I guess. So now I have to head all the way back and we'll grab that last chest and then end the episode off there. I have a feeling that a Cypher member might drop down though, in all honesty. Looks like a place where they would. I'm calling it just here. Yeah, I knew it, I knew it. Wahaha, you thought there was no one this way, didn't you? I, no, I did actually, I knew there was going to be someone here. I got, I'm told you all. Coolest. Coolest. Oh, I come up from the weasel. I'm going to end up losing this battle because I have Pokemon that's asleep, Pokemon that's half dead, and a. <laughs> oh god, and a Wally. Alright, so if things get bad, I'm going to self destruct. Water gun and. Spark wheezing. This where this where Weezing beats me to the punch and self destructs first. That would suck so bad. Oh, I didn't kill it in one hit. This flamethrower is gonna hurt. Damn it! Why can't you kill it in one hit? No! I can't self destruct anymore. Prophecy is asleep. I'm gonna go for a full restore, I think. I don't wanna lose this battle. So we'll do that. So I'm gonna. Icy, would Icy Wind kill Camera Up as well? I don't think Icy Wind would kill Camera Up, but I kinda wanna go for it just in case, but I'm gonna. I'm not gonna risk it. There we go, nice and healthy, and awake, smoke screen. Should heal up first, I knew there was going to be somebody here, I knew it. Right, camera up's dead, that's great. Now we've got Weezing to deal with, which I can flamethrower. Hopefully something comes out which is a fire type and water gun it, or like a flying type, ice beam it, whatever. Hopefully it will be alright. A muck. Ooh. Just gonna double team everything. Just in case. Hopefully she doesn't have a shadow Pokemon, because that would be annoying. Well that's pretty lucky, I went for water gun, so goodbye Rapidash. And there's a shadow, no, damn it. Oh my god, okay, live the water gun, live the water gun, live the water gun. I can get Ultra Ball, Flame for the Muck. Don't do too much damage, that did quite a lot. I did 50. And I got Poison, so one more Sludge and I'm dead. That's annoying. Oh, did that much? What I'm going to do is, I have to do this, risk it, and then, 
full restore. I don't want to waste the full restores, but then I don't want to lose the battle either. So, and she's gonna have two Shadow Pokemon because she sent Rapidash out while having a Pokemon left from the team. So that's uh, that's come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn it! That sucks. Sludge is gonna come in. Acidum, well, that's great. That is. Thank you very much, Muck. Water gun and a flame from Muck. Shadow Ray won't do too much. Water gun won't kill it. Should bring it down to yellow. If we get a critical hit, it's probably gonna die. Hopefully, it doesn't. Flame Pro should hopefully do a lot of damage and potentially kill it. Doesn't kill it, nowhere near. Burn it, burn it, burn it, damn it. Okay, nothing's really going my way at the moment, and I missed! Oh wow, are you serious? Sludge hit Wally, hit Wally, hit Wally. Nice. Don't don't poison, don't poison, don't poison, it's gonna poison. Okay, cool. Um Psychic the muck. And then Actually it doesn't really matter, okay. I'm just gonna kill this muck straight away. That's fine. I knew that was gonna happen. I was debating whether to heal up Wally or revive something, but I kinda felt like it'd be better to revive Lucas. This is the time you want a critical hit. Burn it, burn it, please. Hit Flareon, hit Flareon. Don't poison, please don't poison, please don't poison. That was lucky as hell. Jesus Christ. What does okay, that's fine. Okay, Monk's dead. Next comes up her second shadow Pokemon. Hopefully, it's not something I really want, like the Menetric or Salamence. Definitely won't be Salamence, I bet. Macargo. Is that a shadow? Yep, it definitely is. Don't remember seeing that on the list, to be honest. Oh, it's this one. Everyone takes damage except for Shadow Pokemon. Okay, we're both taking damage, that's fine. Don't do too much. Live that just. Hopefully, Makago doesn't do anything too nasty. Hopefully, we get the flinch, that would be great. Psychic doesn't kill Rapidash. Okay, that's perfect health. Critical hit, of course. Pretty sure we would have died even either way, but still, God of War loves to get critical hit all the time. Okay, I think I can probably capture one, but I'm gonna die to Makago. There's no way out of this. Unless I live with a little bit of HP, just throw an ultra ball to try and get lucky. She might respawn this trainer, so it's not a bad thing. Okay, there's one down. Miss your attack, miss your attack, be cool and miss. Oh, okay, that's fine. I got one of them. I got one of them. Where am I going to spawn? Hopefully... 
by the healing station. Probably not. Probably my room. Ugh. Well, I'm going to end this bar right here. And I'll see you next time we're back at Cypher's Lair. Have a great day. Peace.